Hello hi friends, Apple has finally announced the new iPhone SE, a lower cost iPhone that finally starts at 399. Come let's see in this video what is new about this iPhone along with its pre-order and pricing details. Come let's get started. Talking about display, it has 4.7 inch IPS LCD retina display with a true tone color. It sounds as though it has exactly the same display as it was on iPhone 8. Talking about cameras, there is a single 12 megapixel camera lens on the back along with the flash. Apple says it is using A13 Bionic chip to improve its smart HDR photography which combines multiple shots into a single photo to improve lighting and detail. Rear camera also now supports 4K at 30 frames per second. The front facing selfie camera is 7 megapixel and it is expected to take a decent portrait photos. Although it is relatively old design, this iPhone SE has Apple's A13 Bionic chip, the same that is available in the latest iPhone 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max. Some of the other new features are it supports Wi-Fi 6, Gigabyte, LTE, Dual SIMs, True Tone, Haptic Touch, Argument Reality. Talking about the storage, price, colors and pre-order dates, iPhone SE starts at 399 for a version with 64GB of storage. It is available for pre-order this Friday, April 17th and it will ship on April 24th. There will be a 128GB model offered for 449 and 256GB model for 549. Like other iPhones, it will come with a, a year free of Apple TV+. It will come in black, white and product red. In the box, you will get iPhone with iOS 13, earpods with lightning connector, lightning to USB cable, USB power adapter, yes, it is a 5V power adapter and documentation. The 2020 iPhone SE is another major smartphone release coming in the midset of this pandemic. The SE's lower cost and touch ID sensor may have slightly more appeal than usual. The iPhone SE looks like a very good overall deal. It's a $400 phone with what appears to be a strong camera and a very same processor that is in Apple's the most expensive iPhone 11 Pro and 11 Pro Max. If you are someone who loves iOS and would like to have a small phone with a better specs then this phone could be a better choice. Friends, what do you think about this new iPhone SE? Do let us know your opinion in the comment section below. If you like this video, please give it a like and hit the subscribe button for more tech videos. Stay safe and thank you for watching iTrek.